Well, maybe it wasn't the final score that soccer fans were hoping for today, but Team USA will still be moving on in World Cup competition, and that's the important thing. The team fell to Germany 1-0 this afternoon down in Brazil, but local fans, many of them, took a long lunch today to take in the game and support the red, white, and blue. Now, we stopped by the Frickers in Washington Township where crowds gathered around all those TVs. American flags lie in the area outside the restaurant, and inside, the support was also very visible. Fans tell us they're very excited this U.S run will continue. Anytime you have an opportunity to extend some patriotism, it's a great time. And the United States men's team has done really well. They've been the underdog. No one gave them a shot at all. They were in the death group, and sure enough, now we're advancing. I mean, it, today's game didn't turn out the way we wanted it, but it's, a, it's about a bigger thing. It's not just about today's game. It's about advancing. I believe that we will win. That was a big popular <laughs> well, chant. Sometimes you, know, you come up a little bit short. Sometimes you win and you but, lose. But it really, two news sports director Jack Pohl here joining us. It really, Jack, is, even though we lost, it still is a win. Yeah, I mean, it's never good to lose. Let's get that yeah. out of the way first. Everyone wanted to win today, or at least a draw. That would kind of punch your own ticket. But as it turns out, the U.S. team lost to Germany 1 0, but they still move on to the knockout round of 16 of the World Cup. Thanks to Portugal's 2-1 to win over Ghana, the U.S. advances based on goal differential. Now, this is the first time the Americans have advanced to consecutive knockout rounds in their history. Not too bad at all. Now, it is a little confusing, though, for fans who don't follow soccer year-round. All right, do we know when and where they play next? Well, Mark, it looks like the United States will play Belgium coming up on Tuesday, July 1st. That is the most likely scenario at the moment, but it also it's also possible the U.S. could face Algeria, depending on what happens the rest of this afternoon. We will know for sure in about an hour or so, and uh, I'll let you know then. All right, but they advance. They are moving on. That's the bottom line. With the line. chant. Let's keep the chant <laughs> going. Right. All right, Jack, thank you. More